to invest in preparedness is not so sexy. Um, it's, it's much easier. Resources become available when a disaster strikes and then everybody wants to donate. And we know it's too late. In the context of hospital care and hospital emergency care and disaster care, we know that the, most, the, the cost efficient way is to in fact invest so the hospitals not collapse because of earthquakes. This is the cheapest way to do it. Hospitals, even existing facilities, uh, the, the technology exists now from an engineering perspective to strengthen them with beams and so on so they don't collapse. But it's impossible to get money to do this before. That everybody will rush in with millions of dollars worth of, of field hospitals and so on that can could have probably pre-earthquake or pre-disaster built two or three uh, solid facilities in country X. That this is the dilemma we are in in, uh, in this context.